hello my lovely people welcome back to my channel i greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video we are still on the gist from the palace of oni of ife uh, allegedly information reaching us right now is that olori mariam uh, was down in tears uh, about yesterday altercation with dr elizabeth according to what we are hearing they said that it wasn't an easy thing or that she was down as in down in tears because they said the king was supporting Dr. Elizabeth concerning the issue they had, uh, she had with Mariam yesterday. Because we do know that uh, this, uh, they, they said that the king is very serious this time concerning them leaving the palace and all of that. And, but the uh, problem they're having now is that they said Dr. Elizabeth wants to stay back. And Mariam said that it is not going to happen. That if uh, the Oloris are to leave the palace for Queen Naomi to return back, that definitely all of them are going to leave. That if Dr. Elizabeth did not live with them, that she is not going to leave the palace. And that brought a very big altercation between uh, Mariam and Dr. Elizabeth. They said, they gave themselves woto woto, as in the air. Uh, they said, uh, Dr. Elizabeth told Mariam that you are a bad influence, that you are a bad, very bad energy to this royal house, that ever since you entered, all you care about how to uh, connive with other people to uh, frustrate some people out of the palace, that even other Oloris in the palace, that they are always afraid of you because they don't know what you have done to the king that made the king to always support you to give everybody wild booze and nothing is happening. That day you are the only person that can insult the king, that do everything, that wherever they are talking about anything bad, that Olori Mariam will be there. So this thing went on and on and on. But since Dr. Elizabeth came back, uh, enters the palace, uh, all her efforts was geared towards uh, re reuniting the king and bringing Queen Naomi back to the palace because she realizes that for the palace to be in peace and for everyone to enjoy that uh, marriage, that the first wife, who is also the mother to the heir apparent to the throne, must be in that palace for that to happen. But Mariam doesn't care. She don't give a damn about who is happy or not. That all she cares about is herself. That she's a selfish human being and all of that. They said uh, Dr. Elizabeth gave it to her the, ne the way she never expected. Even when she keeps reminding Dr. Elizabeth that, look, you are in this palace because of me. That if not for me, that you, shouldn't, you wouldn't have been here. That you owe me respect. You owe me uh, appreciation and not attitude. You owe me a great attitude, uh, 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 gratitude, not attitude. That all this attitude of yours towards me, I don't know what you intend to achieve. That if there's anyone you should uh, you are, that you are supposed to be with, you know, it is me and not being against me. That ever since you entered this uh, palace, you have turned my husband against me. That I am not going to fold my arms and allow a small girl like you who happens to be the last wife to come and take my position in this life, in this palace, that if at all anyone is to stay back, that it is me, I mean Mariam, you know? <laughs> they said that it wasn't an easy thing. And during this period now, they said uh, what the king w did was to tell Mariam that it is not in your place to determine who stays or who doesn't stay. You know, you are just a wife. And it is in my position. If there's anyone, maybe let's say the women who have such right, it is with Naomi who determines who will stay or who will not stay. And from the look of things, let's not forget that uh, Dr. Elizabeth is the reason why uh, uh, Queen Naomi and Oni are still in talking terms. Because they said initially, before Queen, uh, Dr. Elizabeth's arrival, that uh, Queen Naomi have uh, stopped picking the king's call, don't respond to his messages and all of that. It was Dr. Elizabeth's mother who called, uh, who reached out to Queen Naomi and her mother and talked sense into Queen Naomi that made her to start picking the king's call again. 
and that is when the arrangement of uh, Dr. Elizabeth, uh, Dr. Dr. Queen Naomi returning back to the palace started taking place. Although we do know that she was planning to come back to the palace until the king marries uh, the last wife, which is uh, uh, Dr. Elizabeth. And they said ever since then that she don't care about uh, coming back again. She was so upset that uh, she thought that the king had uh, stopped the issue of marrying more women until that one happened. But she never knew that Dr. Elizabeth is, is going to be better than all other wives in that palace. So they said it was when, when uh, Dr. Elizabeth arrives that she started making a uh, process, processing on how the two will unite. And as God may have it, it is better now because they said they now discuss, they now pick, because they now arrange, you know. You know? So uh, considering that, you know, looking from uh, that direction, if there's anyone that will stay back in the palace, it is supposed to be Dr. Elizabeth. But if you ask me, my own opinion, no, the best thing to do is let all of them leave. Yes. You see, for this relationship that is between Dr. Elizabeth and Queen Naomi to last, it will be better that they live in separate places. Because if they live together in that palace, you will find out that time will come. Because they are women, and women will always do what, they, what makes them women. So as long as they live together, they will have issues with time, you know. So and to avoid this, it will be better that uh, all of them live separately, so that there won't be any issue later. So that the relationship will last longer. So they said, well, after uh, the king made it clear to when uh, Mariam that look you don't have the right to determine who stays or who doesn't stay this is my palace and if you are not ready to do as i say you better use the exit door so my people they said since then that mariam ha uh, has been in tears saying that uh, dr elizabeth have buy the king over that this and that and no wonder some people said that uh, that the king is unable to uh, put mariam to her position because she always uh, supplied the king with money and all of that. I don't know how true that is, but all I know is that uh, uh, it's beginning to look as if the king have uh, woken up from her from his slumber and is ready to do the needful. Anyways, we just wish for the uh, uh, best. Let them live. If you ask me, for my own interest. In, if you ask me to say, it will be better that all of them leave so that we know me will return back to the palace. And if they are leaving, let it make them, make it fast. It's not an issue of uh, giving them from now till the end of the year. From now till the end of the year is too far. But anyways, if that is uh, what it will take for the palace to be sanitized, because it needs a total sanitization and clearance, so be it. Anyways, guys, don't forget that they are all gist. They are all alleged information, okay? I just saw it on social media and I thought I should come and share with you. Please consider giving this video a thumbs up and share. Subscribe to my channel if you are yet to subscribe. And turn on the notification bell so that you get notified this time I upload a new content. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much. My God will bless you. See you guys soon. Bye for now. Love you guys.